Welcome back to my channel. So I'm doing another CVS haul for you guys because I recently got a coupon sent to my email. It's for $5 off of a $15 purchase. Now, I don't know if that's something they're sending to everyone. Um, I think it's something that they're sending for the Labor Day weekend. So if you want to go buy, like, you know, sodas or stuff like that, if you're having a party, something like that, um, I think that's why they're sending them out. But uh, I didn't find any videos really talking about how to utilize that $5 off of 15 So I kind of had to go in the store and, like, make up my own deal because I could use it on Sunday when the new deals come out but I'm really not into anything that I see for next week so I kind of wanted to just use it now um and I did get some extra bucks back so I can use for next week so that's even great um now this is not the only deal that you can do um if you're lucky enough to have the calendula cream still at your store you can use it on that um, but my store was completely out. I went to two CVS's and I'm not going to go to a third CVS just for some cream. Um, I'm still debating whether I want to get a rain check or not. I might go in there and just ask for a rain check so that way I can use it next week. Um, but I, I don't know. I'm kind of, I'm debating right now. So let me know in the comments when I post this video if I should get a rain check or not. I might just do it just so that I can use the extra bucks I got from this trip, pay for that, and then get my extra bucks right back. So we'll see. I'll, I'll think about that. But... Anyway, um, so you can use it on that. Um, there's also some shampoo deals if you haven't done your deals yet for like the L'Oreal and Pantene. So if you want to follow um, any of those, I will put my video below as well as couponing with Tony's video. Um, I also included her in my last video talking about my um, money making deal there. So if you have not got your deals yet and you want to go utilize it, that's a good time to do it because you can take the $5 off. Um, of your transaction so it'll work out to be a lot better of a money maker than what I had had but um, I did not get that coupon until like two days after my shopping trip so I couldn't use it because I didn't expect to get it anyways so what I decided to do was a makeup deal um, I've been wanting to pick up the uh, Maybelline Better Skin um, concealer because apparently um, according to like all the dupes I've been reading this is a dupe for um, the NARS and the um, MAC concealer and I am not about paying that much money for a concealer so this has got really really good reviews so I really wanted to try it um, however in the store it is eight dollars and I think it was like 29 cents or something like I uh, know 849 and my CVS that was regular price so I don't know how much they vary between regions but this was 849 as well as this. This is the Maybelline Last, 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 oh my goodness, let's rewind here. Lash Sensational Mascara. They have two. Um, there's a black one and a pink one. I was more intrigued in this one. I don't know if you can see the packaging very well. Um, that it says it gives you dense and supple lashes and it's very volumizing. So, and it's got a fanning brush, which I haven't even opened it yet, so I don't know what the brush looks like, but there's a picture of it on the back. So, this intrigued me as well. Um, so, let me grab you guys my receipt. They um, had, if you spend $15 in Maybelline Cosmetics, you get a $5 ECB back, which is what I got. And so, what I decided to do, because, like I said, they didn't have the cream. I already picked up my L'Oreal for the week, as well as my toothpaste and... Um, the Garnier and all that stuff you can see in my last video so I didn't really have anything mm. I let the, the door open so the, the dogs could like run around for a little while and obviously that was a bad decision because they're just loud anyway so um, yeah so I didn't I didn't have anything left that I wanted to buy and I like I said I wanted to try these so I thought it was a good time to go ahead and try them so, um, basically, like I said, they're $8.49 a piece, and then, um, I don't remember which newspaper this coupon came out in. I think it was $8.21. I'm not 100% sure. If I, I'm going to go find it and then let you know in the comments, but basically, it was a $2 off of any of the Better Skin line, and this is the cheapest one that CVS had. Um, the foundations and the powders and stuff were like $10, $11, so I wasn't going to do that. Um, so I used it on this. Then um, I had a $3 off coupon for this. 
um, the mascara, which was also $8.49. So this one I think just came out recently in um, not this week's, but I think last week's paper. Or maybe it was this week. I'll put it down in the, in the info bar for you guys if you really need to know which one it was. But there was $3 off of this one or the pink one. But like I said, this one kind of attracted my attention more. So I just picked up the black one. Then I had um, two, I had $3 in extra bucks from my last video. If you want to watch that one, um, I got $2 from the two gallons of milk that I bought. And I got a dollar from the Elmer's glue. So I used the $3. And then, um, like I said, there was a $5 off of a $15 um, CVS purchase that I got emailed to me. So my subtotal came out to $3.98, and I paid $4.31 with taxes. So I did save $13, and 77%, um, if you want to break it down, did get um, a $5 ECB back. And... What's cool about CVS, if you're not familiar with CVS, I didn't really look at it till right now, that um, if you spend more than the 15 like I did, I actually spent $16.98. So I got the overage from the $15 applied to a, another purchase. So basically what that means is if you have um, more of these coupons, so if you've got um, another $3 coupon and another $2 coupon, because you buy multiple papers like I do, you can go back and as long as you spend $13.02, you can get another $5 reward. So I will show you here on the bottom. I spent $16.98 this trip, so anything past $15, it applied to basically round two. So if I want to go back and do it again, I can. I just need to spend $13.02 and I get another $5 extra buck. But I don't think I'm going to do that because... Um, I don't need anything else from like Maybelline and I don't really have um, a need to buy another mascara and another concealer but I'll think about that. So yeah, four, $4.31 with taxes is not bad considering retail this is $8. Even at the cheapest for my region it's maybe like $7.50 at like my HEB because they usually have cheaper cosmetics. So to get both of them for $4 is not bad in my opinion. So there you go, you guys. If you have a $5 off of $15, you are not too sure what to do with it, you can go ahead and do this deal. I think it's worth it. And then if you want to roll these $5 into um, more, you know, shampoo or anything like that, go ahead and do that. But I think I'm just going to hold off on mine and save it for something that I might need later. Or like I said, go get a ring check for the Calendula Cream and that way it'll come out to like a dollar. And then um, there's a $3 rebate on Ibotta, and there's also the $3 off coupon. So it'll make it a money maker instantly for me. So I'm going to hold on to this one. And yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments again if you think I should get a rain check for the cream. And if you want to see a review on these products, um, if I think they were good, if I, you know, liked them, if I am going to go back and buy another one for round two, we'll see. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know in the comments like I said. Um, follow my social media below. My last week's video will be, I'm sorry, my last video will be in the, in the description as well as couponing with Tony's video. So that if you need some last minute run deals, you can go ahead and get those. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.